So I have now been on the, this uh, yoga opening here and uh, I have uh, a yoga mat apparently. So I have actually booked uh, one of the other classes that they have. I don't know exactly where it's going to be but the area is like over here. So I think uh, uh, it might even be on this uh, this stage but I will see so I think I'm gonna go because uh, now I don't know what time it is I think it's around 9 it's still very early so let's see what, what they have over here I need to check the time of this now so I think that yoga class that I booked was at 10 maybe I think it's at uh, 10 I don't see anything on my screen, honestly. Yeah. So I think uh, the yoga class I will is at 10, and uh, so I have like 45 minutes. So I think I'm gonna go to the beach, unless I go to eat something. Uh, I'm not so hungry yet, so I think I'm just going to go to the beach and have a look. Let's see what it looks like. So the yoga class was with uh, this lady, I think she's called uh, what is her name? The, the Pika Meta, something like this. I actually booked a backbending with her tomorrow, so I think potentially I have one more yoga class with her. So the yoga class was quite short, I, I'm assuming it was uh, due to the opening and uh, uh, I will see what the other one is going to be like. Uh, but we did some, some salutations at least, you know. So it was just the basic. So now I'm gonna show you the beach. I have this yoga mat and I need to drink water. But very nice to be on the beach this early in the morning. So I'm gonna show you. Where is my yoga mat? So I will take you to the beach. I think I should just take off my shoes, but I don't know where to put my where to put my shoes. So uh, the sun salutations was uh, uh, was basically just you know like the more mundane, <laughs> mundane like the basic ones, you know like. Sun salutation A. There was some uh, modifications also on the sun salutation, so there were no uh, jump backs in the, in the beginning. I don't know how many sun salutation it ended up being. Maybe not that many. I didn't feel like I had uh, done any yoga after that, but you know, it's good because I booked this other thing. And now I don't remember. What, what yoga I actually booked because uh, uh, I just, uh, I booked uh, two, three classes for tomorrow and then two for today. But I don't remember if the one that is now at ten was called Hatha Prana Hatha Prana Yoga. I think it's actually Hatha Prana Yoga. So. I'm going to try and find the, the place for where that is going to take place, you know. But now I'm going to remove my shoes and then I'm going to step with my feet into the water. And I actually have this book with me. Uh, a season in Mecca, which is written by this anthropology professor who went on a pilgrimage uh, like on the Hajj to, to Mecca and he like uh, uh, reported on his uh, experience and uh, wrote a book on it and I had to read it for one of my courses that I had so I am halfway through it and it's a very simple kind of read like it's not that much actually to read through but for the sake of 
sake of it, I'm going to try and read it, you know. So I figure maybe if I have 45 minutes, I can sit here and read. And then I can do that other yoga class. And then I have to go to the marina. And I need to, I have um, two lectures. And I have one new uh, paper to write for. Like, I'm going to get the instructions for a paper, you know. Uh, that I need to write for. So I that. But I think I'm going to try and sit by the pool maybe or something, you know. See how that goes. Also, I saw my my uh, girl, my my, uh, my housemate in the morning when I was uh, up, and we were just talking about yoga. And she had a book she was going to recommend to me, but I don't remember the name on it. And she actually fell asleep before she had the chance to tell me. But uh, she had met some yoga yoga person in uh, in her country I think and he had recommended her a book and said she should read it if she wants to learn about uh, yoga and stuff. I mean I have read about yoga and I mean I read about all kinds of things but uh, it seemed quite interesting the book and um, I'm just going to see what what uh, the title on that one was because maybe I can uh, just for the just for the fun of it, you know, and uh, so yeah. But I had quite a nice, you know, morning, and it's only nine o'clock, so that's pretty good. I'm going to remove this thick shirt. So, so I think I'm going to try and read, and then I also brought my laptop with me because. Uh, I will see when, because I think that yoga class is ending at uh, uh, 11.30 or something, so I, after that I might going to actually take a walk, and uh, so I will see how I'm going to do it, or if I go directly back to the marina, because uh, I will see, um, I'm going to see this, uh, <coughs> see this uh, girl, you know, like, uh, but I think she's, uh, She's probably going to be asleep because she has been, uh, you know, she has been uh, working, in the, working in the, in the night, you know. So she's not going to be. Asleep. I don't think so. So, uh, actually, I was surprised because you got like a, you got like a, a block, yoga block, and uh, the, the um, sort of. Uh, uh, the one that has uh, sponsored this event is called Dubai Holding. And also a yoga mat. And uh, as I was telling in the video before this one, I didn't have a yoga mat. So I was thinking exactly how I was going to do yoga. But apparently they was, uh, you know, having, uh, uh, having those yoga mats like available. And there was, uh, they had also put prices. So underneath the yoga mats, there was like some stickers, and the people who had a sticker, they got like a prize. Uh, I didn't have a sticker, but I'm happy either way. <laughs> so yeah, so that was also interesting, you know. Uh, they do have a, um, like an organic form of market here, which is called Ripe Market, and it's somewhere in the, you know, somewhere in this area, you know. So. I'm not gonna go and see if they have something to eat, you know, because um, they tend to have quite nice, uh, um, you know, vegetables and these things. So, and I haven't been on any ripe market since I was here maybe two years ago. I don't. Know. So, but it was a long time ago, so I might go and check it out and see if they have something. And um, yeah. So I'm very, like now, uh, once I go on this other yoga class, I'm just going to bring the block. I don't know if we're going to do any, because Hatha Prana, I'm assuming, is like uh, holding poses and you are breathing through it, you know. So, uh, so it's not like Vinyasa where you're flowing through and it's not either Ashtanga where it's like a structured system. Uh, and it's not Kundalini. Kundalini is more like meditation. So I'm thinking Hatha Yoga is something in between all of that. So, now we'll see. So, yeah. 
Uh, what else? Yeah, so, but you can see they also have... Uh, so this is, by the way, the kite beach I uh, shared in the other video. And um, uh, typically in the weekends they have like all types of, you know, uh, different events and things here and also just common beach so there's a lot of tourists and also they put these uh, food trucks and stuff so you can actually go and have food uh, if you're hanging on the beach and then uh, and then what else uh, and also they do in kite surfing so you know you can go and kite surf here on the beach and uh, so that's really nice you know but, and also they have a big mosque here, right on the beach, uh, or next to the beach, you know, so on the other side there's a big mosque. And, uh, so yeah, that's really nice, you know. And there is uh, a lot of butterflies here on the beach, I don't know where they came from. There was even butterflies on the yoga mat. So, let's see how many minutes, this is 11 minutes. I think I'm going to end here and try and read that uh, book for a couple of minutes and then I might go and check out that ripe market if they have something to eat and then I'm going to go and see where is that uh, other yoga class going to be and then after I have uh, attended I'm going to probably take a short walk maybe check out other parts of the beach and then I'm going to go back to the marina and. Uh, have a look at my lectures and that paper that I need to write and I also need to finish this master paper and uh, this uh, other uh, course assignment that I also have. But I think I'm going to try and stay outdoor quite a lot today so I'm probably going to try and sit by the pool in the GBR you know so we will see how that goes in my education. So yeah but the beach here is amazing if you're coming to Dubai you should definitely check out the uh, the kite beach because it's very popular and also you can see the Burj Al Arab and uh, it's like uh, quite good location you know